Tonight, the family of Sergeant Lucas Beechnaw working to make sure as many of his colleagues and friends across the country can attend his funeral if possible. The Sergeant Beechnaw's body will arrive at the Gerald R. Ford International Airport tomorrow morning. That's where we find 24 Hour News 8's Jessica Leffler. Jess. Ryan, the family is fundraising to help soldiers pay for the trip here, whether that be fly into the airport or for other expenses like their hotel or even their food while they're here. Sergeant Lucas Beechnaw was killed in a firefight in Afghanistan. His body's going to arrive tomorrow, and visitation is also set for tomorrow at Ada Bible Church from 2 to 4, and then again from 6 until 8. The service is going to take place on Friday and is going to be handled through Rothgerst Funeral Home. And then will take place at Ada Bible Church at 10:30 in the morning with an hour-long visitation prior to the service. We spoke with Jamie Beechnaw, that's Sergeant Beechnaw's sister, about their fundraising efforts. She tells us, above all, her brother was a funny, caring, and compassionate person, and somebody who would want to help his friends and people he considered family take care of their expenses. Um, we know how it was with Lucas, like you know. They they don't have a lot of money, but they they truly are you know they're brothers to each other, and they would be here you know if they had to walk or sleep outside. But you know they I know that they would be here regardless, and so we just want to make sure that they that they're taken care of. There is a memorial fund sent up at Huntington Banks across the country. If you want more information about how you can donate or help, you can go to our website at woodtv.com. For now, we're live in Kent County. I'm Jessica Leffler, 24-hour News 8. Back to you. Thank you, Jess. As we mentioned, Beechnaw's body will be brought back to West Michigan tomorrow. The plane is expected to land at the Ford Airport around 9.30. A procession will then go to the Roth Gers Funeral Home in Lowell. There will be a short ceremony there. Visitation will be tomorrow from 2 to 4 and 6 to 8 at Ada Bible Church on Cascade Road. Funeral services will be Friday, 1030 in the morning. Beach Nall will then be buried at a cemetery in St. John's, north of Lansing.